Well, I think the one thing that discipline definitely does help you with is it, it helps you get things done. And when you get things done, when you, you, you actually do things, you, 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 you have more success. If you have more success, and sometimes a, a big part of success is just not being fucking lazy and just doing it. Yeah. Just get, that's like 90% of it is just showing up. Get there and start working. Like, you're not going to feel perfect every day. If I felt, if I only worked out when I felt good, I'd be a fat fuck. Because there's a lot of days I don't want to do it. I mean, it's pretty much the same with everybody that if, that actually gets good at something. You, you get, there's got to be those days you push through. I have had such exacting, such stringent standards for myself. Why would I then have less exacting, stringent standards on the people I meet? Why would I put myself through hell to be me and then meet someone who didn't put themselves through hell and then treat them like my equal? No, I suffered when you didn't. So you're not my equal because you decided not to suffer. You have enjoyed comfort when I haven't and that's fine, but don't expect me to look at you as my equal because you're not. And it's that old expression, it's better to be a warrior in a garden than a gardener in a war. It's an old expression, but it makes sense. Because mm -hmm. it doesn't mean that you can't be kind if you're strong. But it does mean you can't be strong if you're weak. If you're weak, you're fucked. You should be a monster. You know, because everyone says, well, you should be harmless. Virtuous. You shouldn't do anyone any harm. You should sheath your competitive instinct. You shouldn't try to win. You don't want to be too aggressive. You don't want to be too assertive. You want to take a back seat and all of that. It's like, no. You should be a monster. An absolute monster. And then you should learn how to control it.